What's poppin' Thai Pack? It's your girl Ty and I'm back with another video. Before we jump into the video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Click that notification bell, you know what I'm saying? And follow your girl on social media because she need to get her followers up. Just like she need to get them subscribers up. And I, ooh. Now. talk about how to stay faithful um to me being faithful isn't really it's not difficult you know it's the easy it's the easy part to me but let's get right into the video all right if i keep looking down gotta itch hold up but if i keep looking down it's because i have my notes so don't mind me um, the first thing I would say is always communicate. Let each other know how you're feeling from inside and out, you know what I'm saying? What you be thinking, all that. Let each other know what's up. Always communicate. The second thing I would say is avoid the tree, the cheating traps, period, you know? Because, you know, when you see single, it seems like nobody wants you. But as soon as you get somebody or you're in a relationship, Everybody wants to slide in your DMs, text your phone, and oh, you been you acting bad. Oh, baby, no, I acting bad. I'm good. I'm with somebody. I'm good, baby. I'm good. Something that you have to just accept is that you will always find other people attractive. That's with anybody. You know, there's always going to probably be someone that looks better than your spouse or that got a better body than your spouse or anything like that but all that doesn't matter you know what i'm saying because when it comes down to it it's what's in it's what's what's in you know what i'm saying and it's like if you find other people attractive that's no problem but it's all about how you if you put forth effort and going forward to putting in these steps to really see what they're working with you heard me Oh, yes. But another thing I would say is stay intimate. I know a lot of things change in relationships with that, but I would just say try to stay intimate. Always think about what that person, always think about what that person really means to you. Like, think about all, all the experiences y'all have been to, what they really mean to you, that friendship, that bond. Think about everything because... When it comes to a lot of situations, you will look at it and be like, okay, the grass is green on the, on the other side, and it doesn't even be that way, you know what I'm saying? Everybody come with their baggage, everybody have their problems, so you just gotta work with people. Your relationships, like I say all the time, it's a job, it work. You gotta, you gotta put in that work, put in that work. But always to think about what that person means to you and why you don't want to lose them, because that's the main thing that I feel like will really help you make your decision with this whole faithful thing. Even though my main thing, hold up, 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 hold up. Let me say this. Cheating is not, it's not okay to me. So I'm not going to stress this enough. If you feel like you want to cheat, leave. Bye. Leave. Don't stay and do all the other stuff. If you go through all these steps and you still feel like you want to cheat, leave. Because, baby, cheat on the right one. Cheat on the right one. And it's going to be hell. To pay. Always try to impress your lover. People, once you get in relationships, you become comfortable and... You stop doing the things that you were doing to either get the person or just even having date night, doing fun activities. You just become comfortable and you don't put forth the effort that you used to do when you was trying to get them or in the beginning of the relationship. So always try to put forth that effort and impress that person because you shouldn't just feel like, oh, I got him, so I don't have to do all that anymore. 
you always should keep growing, having fun, and like making memories as a couple. Like nobody wants to be in a relationship and it just be boring. That's why most people end up going to cheat anyway because they feel like, oh, it's boring or other things, which is for another video. One thing you should just realize is that our relationships are going to take work. Our relationships are going to go through changes. Each person is going to grow individually and y'all y'all are going to grow together. So when it comes to it, you have to really have patience and be willing to put in a lot of work. You can't just expect a relationship to be easy because it's not easy or you can't understand that person or because you have an argument, you feel like, oh, I'm going to just go cheat. That's not how it goes, you know what I'm saying? When, when you get married, what you're going to do sit there and vow before that person and God and also be like, well, you boring now, you know what I'm saying? So I ain't worried about that or I got you. So while I'm doing all that, you my wife, you my husband, what I'm doing all that for. And that shouldn't be how things are. You should always just, like I said, keep growing. You think people that's been together for 20, 30, 40 years, anything like that, your grandma and your grandpa been through some shit, you hear me? Your great grandma and your grandpa, great grandpa been through even worse shit. You feel me? Cause we all know dumb people back in the days was cutting me up. Okay. Just try to always understand, be open. Like, do always do things to make the, that person smile. You can't just get in a relationship and just like I said, get comfortable and feel like, oh, it's whatever. Because it's not whatever. It's not whatever. That's That'll either make your partner feel like, oh, you know, I love him and I want to stay with him or her. But at the same time, I'm going to get what I'm getting from this other one because they giving me that, you know? That's just like if you feel like, oh, I got her. I don't have to take her on dates. I don't have to, you know, make sure I give him sex often or whatever I mean it's going to push the person into another person's hand if they're weak and if you're the weak one that feels like you got to go ahead and go step out or anything like that then you need some help you feel me Um, and then a lot of people don't cheat just because they're weak you know it's many many things to that so like I said that will be another video but being faithful, it's not hard. It's not hard. The hard part is the relationship. That's the hardest part. You know what I'm saying? Keeping y'all two, two separate people, two separate mindsets, two separate spirit souls, whatever, you feel me? Coming together. Coming together and have to make decisions and everything deal with life situations and everything together i mean relationship and then your relationship problems so sometimes it's a lot for people but like i said get the right one it'll be worth it it'll be worth it so like i said before if you feel like you want to cheat on anybody before you make that step take that step Either put in the work for them to do, like, let them know what's what the problem is. Be like, this is the problem, and and I feel like we should do this or anything like that. Or you tell them the problem and y'all figure out a way to come together and work through that. And if y'all can't figure it out, then you leave because cheating isn't going to do anything but make things worse. And like I said, being faithful ain't hard. Just leave when you're tired of being faithful. That's it. That's all, baby. So you gotta zoo. You know? But that's all your girl had to say today. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. And leave me any topics. Or you can go ahead and DM me on any of my social medias. And let me know any topics or anything that you guys want me to talk about. I am looking for different people to start coming on my channel also and do challenges with me and also having conversations i want to do it young people older people all that 
everybody with different topics. So if you're looking forward to, if you want to do any of that, just hit me up on my social medias. You know what I'm saying? But I'm a hey, disclaimer, disclaimer. Baby boys, hit me up if you want to work, okay? That's it. Anyways, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe, and follow me on all my social medias. Also, if you haven't already, join the pack, guys. Tryna choke on these nuts So I huh? She asked me to put it in her butt Now you still